Hi everyone, I finally found the time to edit the next video. I also want to thank you for 20 subscribers, over 200 clicks on episode 1 and over 100 clicks on episode 2. If you enjoy this video, please leave a like and subscribe to not miss any future videos. This time we will redesign and widen the concept of the fire starter. Again, most inspiration came from the comments. There were also a few comments who suggested different typings like ice or electric, which were both cool but very was fitting the concept the best. The comments also suggested an overarching theme, different types of stories. The grass starter represents history stories, the water starter represents ghost stories and the fire starter fairy tales. One trope I realized was also fitting was different fantasy role tropes. I know it was already kinda done with Gen 6, but it was fitting nonetheless. The grass starter is the healer, the water starter the warrior, and the fire starter the animal companion. The first form will be based on the small animal companion that nearly every show has. They're usually cute and everybody loves them. The first evolution is based on the middle-sized companion. They are still cute but more mature and can be threatening. The last stage is based on the large companions. They are usually quite strong and capable of fighting and protecting. The changes of the first stage are quite subtle. Pulse stayed the same, but I changed the pattern on its belly into something less obvious than a flame. It now is supposed to be a volcano. Its paws resemble stones flying around during an eruption. And the fluffy fur around its neck is supposed to look like smoke. The paws will later turn into boots made of cool down lava. Also, the first stage does not have wings already, they grow after the first evolution. And here's the redesign of the first stage. I didn't change the name, I quite like it. The second stage redesign is also not crazy different, just some small adjustments. The fur around its neck grows bigger, same goes for the rock boots. I simplified the antlers and made them less pointy so you don't accidentally step your eyes when you cuddle it. I also decided to give it a tail that already hints at the theme of the final evolution. I wanted this line to be cute, cool and badass at the same time. There are already a few rabbit Pokemon and it's not that I dislike them, but I wouldn't use one on my team. I wanted to change that. So here's the new second stage, Rebel Main. I'm quite happy with the redesign, I think it fits the whole middle stage aesthetics pretty well. Now to the last stage. It will basically be a cool huge warrior rabbit, like the Tugwell from Fire Emblem Awakening. The final form resembles different mystical animals. Its wings are phoenix wings, also there are small volcanoes on the top. The tail is a stinger like the one the Manticore has. Yeah. 
I also forgot that this fake one is supposed to be antlers, so I had to add them after I line this thing. And here we have the final stage of the fire setup, Rebel Raptor. This stage got the most changes and I'm actually pretty happy how it turned out. I hope you guys like them too. Next to them we have the male protagonist. I drew the concept for this one actually like two years ago. The Seraphite looks a bit like the cheek fluff of Rebel Mix, which was completely accidentally. His name is Liam, which means strong world warrior. Now that the fire star is done, the only one left is Valorath, the grass star. Here you can see the concept art. His concept is explained a bit more in episode 1. To make it short, it is based on a plague doctor, Venetian mess, the trope of the healer and history stories. If you have ideas for a redesign or for new aspects of this fake mom, please let me know in the comments. I have not started the redesign yet, so everything is still open. So that's it with the video, please leave a like, tell me what you think about the fire starter and subscribe to not miss any new content. I'm also still collecting them for the region, so if you have any ideas, you can tell me in the comment below. Anyways, hope you enjoyed the video, see you soon!